Hello everybody and good morning. Okay, so it is Friday, it is March 5th, and I've decided that I'm going to take a me day. So what a me day means is I'm gonna do anything that I wanna do to make myself feel beautiful. <laughs> so that's gonna include getting my nails done for the first time in a year. So I have not gotten my nails done since March, since last year when the pandemic started. And I'm also gonna get my hair done too because it is time for that as well. And a lot of you have been requesting on YouTube that you wanted to see my, um, experience at the salon so that's what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take you guys there I'm gonna show you as to what I get done at the salon and I cannot wait for today it's definitely a much needed day and here we go I'm of course going to be late for my nail appointment so that's a great start to the day but you know we're we're still living we're still driving right here we go okay I'll see you guys in a sec when I'm there Okay, so that was a long time. Just got finished my nails, if you can see. Well, the lighting's not the greatest. But I always opt for baby pink and always neutrals. Like I'll always do nudes or I'll do like whites or something like that. I'm not really a crazy person when it comes to my nails because I tend to wear different color outfits and if I do like a red, then it won't go with my I don't know it's just <laughs> I always tend to go for um, neutral so my face feels so weird right now so my appointment was for 11 o'clock and I just got out and it's almost two o'clock so I was just sitting there doing my pedicure get well getting a pedicure and getting my manicure and my shellac and that's how long it takes and that's the one thing that I hate about when you go to get your nails done is that it literally takes so long so I have a couple more errands that I have to run but I ended up grabbing a pita because I'm starving and I have to go into shoppers because I have an Amazon package I need to return so I ended up getting this one tripod off Amazon and it was supposed to come with a whole bunch of things such as a Bluetooth clicker, a carrying case, um, also like a clamp for your iPhone that can go onto it too if you want to shoot like outdoors. And it didn't come with any of that. <laughs> so obviously I'm returning it. And um, so I got to go into shoppers and return that. What's a good way to put my tripod here? <laughs> anyway, so I'm gonna eat right now. I'm gonna run into shoppers and drop off that package and then we're gonna go to do my hair, get my hair done. So stay tuned. Oh my God, I hate eating in the car, especially when you have a million things on. Like it's just like, it's so hot, but it's so cold outside. <laughs> Anyways, so this is a pita from Pita Pit and it's dripping, okay. Mmm. Avocado is so good. So I've got spinach, I've got avocado, I've got tomatoes, I have cucumbers, I have pickles, on red onions, um, green peppers, chicken, tzatziki, and chipotle. A little bit of chipotle. Cheers to Friday. Cheers, <laughs> Friday. Yeah, that's it. It's like so dark. Is it? Yeah. Okay. I know, that's the one thing I noticed that my hair growth is really coming in. So. It's good. <laughs> Going in the drain. <laughs> Oh, that would be so nice. 
have a big cutting iron like that. This is a good one. Okay, I am back home. Today was such, not a relaxing day. <laughs> it was kind of stressful to be honest with you. So I was at the nail salon, so you know my whole story around that, that it took me about two and a half hours at the nail salon. And then I went and got my hair done. So this is my hair. I got a trim. And another thing too is that I don't know how much footage I got at the hair salon just because they were playing uh, music in the background and I didn't want because um, YouTube obviously has some standards around that in regards to music and copyright and things like that. So I wasn't able to add any of the music footage or I guess the sound footage into it. So I hope I got some stuff anyways and it's always hard because of the lighting and you always have to make sure that you're trying to get the right angles and all that stuff. But anyways, I only got, I every time when I go, I haven't dyed my hair in so long. And every time when I go, I always just get a trim. So that's what we did today, is we did trim. We shaped up around my face. She usually cuts it on an angle, which is excellent. And then last time, um, she actually gave me some curtain bangs, so she just trimmed those up a little bit. I wanted my bangs to stay a little bit longer, just because summer is slowly approaching. <laughs> and I want to clip my hair and my bangs back, because when it's hot outside, I don't want to have bangs and whatnot on my forehead, especially when you're sweating or if you're working out or anything like that. So I really like the length of this and then she blew um, she gave me a blowout and then she added a really thick curling iron into it to give me some loose curls which I love and she also gave me something to share with you guys and she also did this treatment on my scalp today so it's she actually uses the brand Kerastase and I'm a really big fan of this brand as well. So this here is the Intensely Purifying Scrub Cleanser with Sea Salt. It's good for oily prone scalp. So basically with my hair, I am trying to not wash it as much just because I know your natural oils is actually better for your hair and to keep it healthy and shiny and, and natural. So I'm trying to not wash my hair as much so I was actually pushing today was about I think day five or day four hair and without washing it so when you do that you tend to get build up on your scalp and I don't know about you but my scalp tends to be very itchy on like day four and um, sometimes when you scratch you'll actually see like some build up like under your nails maybe that's just me I don't know let me know down below <laughs> if that's you too but if that is you this here is what she tried on me today and she actually gifted me um, this whole tub so I'm gonna really try to give this a go. This should be really good. She did try it on my scalp today and I can just feel that my scalp just feels so clean. There's no buildup, there's no oils, everything just feels really soft. So I'm very happy with this so far. So I'll keep you guys posted as to how it is. I'm gonna give it a, obviously some more tries with it. So I can't wait and also it smells so good too. It smells just so fresh. So I love that. 
So I don't know if this vlog ended up being at all exciting for you. <laughs> I know I couldn't really film in the nail salon, but you did see as to what I got done on my nails. It's just a light baby pink. And then on my toes, I got the exact same color, but it's a little bit hard trying to vlog wearing your mask. And um, it's just when people are around, they don't really want to be in your video. And it's just, how do you cut them out? And it's just, I don't know, it's a little bit difficult to vlog when you're out in public, but yeah, so I really hope that you did enjoy this vlog. I am going to end it here. It is roughly around five o'clock right now. So I'm just waiting for Brandon to come home from work and then we're gonna try to see if we can get a little spot for dinner um, and have a drink because this week has been insane. <laughs> um, but without further ado, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe and follow me on my Instagram. I would love to have you guys there as well. So until next time, bye.